The release of the One UI 7.0 beta update has been delayed for several weeks. It was supposed to come out at the end of July, but it hasn't happened yet. However, it seems like Samsung might finally be ready to launch the update for beta testers as testing has moved to the next stage. Samsung has delayed the release of the One UI 7.0 beta update by several weeks. It was originally expected to arrive at the end of July, but that didn't happen. Now, after a long wait, there are signs that Samsung could finally be ready to roll it out to beta testers. Testing has moved forward to the next phase, which suggests the update might be close to being released. We've learned that many more of Samsung's local subsidiaries like Samsung India and Samsung UK have started testing the One UI 7.0 beta update. This usually happens when Samsung is getting closer to releasing an update. So it seems like Samsung might finally be ready to launch the One UI 7.0 beta program soon. Samsung typically rolls out beta updates in countries like China, Germany, India, Poland, South Korea, the UK, and the USA. The beta version of One UI 7.0 has been in testing in these regions for weeks, and now testing has also begun in other countries that don't usually get the beta update. Recently, Samsung released One UI 6.1.1, and it's now available for several devices including the Galaxy S23 series, Z Fold 5, Z Flip 5, and Tab S9 series. The update first hit Korea five days ago and is now spread into other countries. The big news with this update is Galaxy Artificial Intelligence, which boosts artificial intelligence features to make your device even smarter and more helpful. As a South Korean company, Samsung naturally prioritizes its home market for initial releases. However, users in other regions are now also starting to receive the One UI 6.1.1 update following its debut in Korea. The One UI 6.1.1 update, ranging from 2.5 to 3 gigs depending on the device, is now available to many users. Samsung's focus on One UI 6.1.1 contributed to the delay in releasing One UI 7.0. Additionally, we've heard that part of the delay was also due to Google. That's it for today. What's your thoughts on this? Let me know in the comments section. As always, see you in the next video. Peace out.